Okay, hello map geeks. Late night video for you guys. Um, so here I have ArcGIS Pro open and I just want to show you um, one thing real quick. The, a problem that several of you guys had with the first lab. So um, let us look at the ArcGIS uh, catalog view. If you click the view tab here and click catalog pane or catalog view over here, I'm going to move my little face out of the way. Over here on the right hand side is our ArcGIS catalog. This is the way that we organize files inside um, the ArcGIS desktop software. So um, one of the things that you will notice, um, I'll talk more about some of these options uh, later, but one of the things here is folders. So if you click the little arrow here, so that it opens up, here is the only folder that I can see related to my project. So one of the things that's different about um, the ArcGIS software than your normal Windows view of folders. So in the Windows view of folders, um, if you go down here uh, to File Explorer or something, um, when you double click on a window or on a folder, you will open up that folder and you will see the files that are within that folder, all the files, right? And you can use File Explorer to look for all of the different folders on your computer. Um, sometimes it's true actually that they can be hidden um, by some computer administrator or something by your settings. But in general, you see all the folders that are on your computer. Um, what ArcGIS does is a little different. In order to uh, save loading every single folder that might not be related to your GIS work, basically it hides all the folders unless you specifically connect to that folder. Okay, so in order to see something um, on your, in, within this catalog view, you have to connect to it. Now, in the lab, it told you to save your project inside the folder that had all of the files that you needed. So if you did that exactly perfectly, um, it would automatically show up for you. But uh, several people had a little problem with this. Let me just show you how you connect to a folder. It's super easy. So over here in the catalog pane on the right hand side, um, here's my kitty again. Um, you can mouse over this thing that says folders and then right click on it and it says add folder connection. So you click add folder connection and a new window should pop up and in this new window it should be a lot of the different folders on your computer. Um, so your C drive is the main hard drive for your computer usually. Um, and then we have some commonly used folders like your desktop, your documents, and your downloads. The files used by the lab manual have automatically been saved under your C drive. So I'm going to double click on my C drive. And then I'm going to look for one of these folders that says uh, Esri Press. Esri, remember, is the company that makes this GIS software. So double click on that. And then this is the folder that has all of our files for our um, lab manual. So I'm just going to click once on this folder to highlight it and put the name down here in the bottom of this window. And then I'm going to click OK, and it should pop up over here on the right-hand side 
um, along with the my project folder because that's what that's the folder that where all of the stuff for this project that I haven't done anything with yet um, will automatically save under my project. So I'm going to click here. Um, so now you can see here is my folder where all my files are. If you click this little arrow, here's all the different folders um, that relate to different things in our lab manual. Um, this is a great way to just save all the different things. You can also connect directly to one of these folders here. Um, but try this out. Right click, add folder connection. That's a really simple way to look for folders that otherwise you're not connected to and you won't, won't show up for you. All right, thanks. Bye-bye.